Hi there, welcome to the Affiliate Truths Guide to finding your way around Plesk and today we're going to be looking at how to create a domain within your Plesk uh, dashboard. So here we go, I've, uh, the, the reason for doing this particular video is the wealthy affiliates who we have a lot of respect for have just released their own hosting and uh, I, I had a few problems setting this up to start with, so I know that the you guys out there that are just starting out are going to have a few issues and a few questions. So if you do get stuck, feel free to ask, but the, this video hopefully will give you the insight that you need to find your way around. So I've logged into my hosting. As you can see, uh, the dashboard is here. This is pretty much what the screen will look like. Um, that you might get when you first log in a news section uh, which will come up in the uh, top part underneath my desktop you can close that there is a there's a little tab that says close news and it'll ask you if you're sure and obviously you are so close the news down and then you will have something that looks a little bit like this okay so to create a domain we're gonna go in here and we're gonna click on create a domain it is Again, very, very simple to do, very, very easy to use. And uh, I mean, you, if you think about it logically, it's next, 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 next. But you just have to make sure that you follow the, uh, the, the steps in the right order. So here we go. Uh, I've got to put in my na domain name. So I'm going to put in golf swing expert.net. I am in no means a golf swing expert, but I do have a, a book that I promote um, regarding golf. So there we go, we've put that in, and we're gonna click on next. Okay, it's saying here that, it's warning me that it actually resolves at the moment to a different IP address. That is because I have that particular domain set up to go somewhere else at the moment but I want to use the Wealthy Affiliate hosting for it, so I'm going to move it over to here, which you would do within your domain registration. Uh, that's something we'll come back to in a minute. Here you can see the information set up. How much do I want to use? Well, I'm putting a uh, maximum of 10 subdomains I can put in there. I'm putting in a uh, maximum number of domains, uh, domain aliases is five, 200 megabytes of disk space. On the uh, Wealthy Affiliate hosting, I'm allowed three domains and I'm allowed 600 megabytes. So obviously it splits everything straight down the middle. So web users is one, database is one, maximum number of mailboxes is five, uh, mailbox quota is six to 600 megabytes. Uh, maximum number of mail redirects is five and so on uh, so we click on next again here we go so what do we actually want to do do we, do we want standard forwarding frame forwarding physical hosting if you're, you're actually putting a website up you want physical hosting so you just click on the physical hosting and you click on the next button it's really difficult isn't it <laughs> okay here we go if you do, I mean, I, I'm just putting up landing pages. I, I, I'm not putting up anything complicated with this one. It's going to be a straightforward landing page uh, thrown together in HTML. I may even use one of the wealthy affiliate templates that are available. Um, so I don't need SSL at all. This is a, this is a securing your your hosting. Uh, FTP login. Well, I'm going to use Cat's Hooper. Uh, cats Hooper 10 because there's probably 500 Cats Hoopers set up already by me. Uh, I'm going to put in my password. And we're going to scroll down. Now, here you see that you have more options. There, this is the reason for making this video is uh, this can make things a little bit complicated. Um, Apache ASP support. You, unless you really know what you're doing, you don't really need this. The The only one I would suggest that you really go for is the PHP support. The reason that I say this is because I use a lot of uh, WordPress and Joomla, and that uses PHP. So having PHP support available so that you can throw up a quick website if you want to, 
using Joomla or WordPress or any of the other free software packages that come with it. I don't think Joomla comes with Plesk, but um, you, you can go in and you can make sure that you've got PHP support up and running and Bob's your uncle, as they say, and uh, you can get up and running. So we click on finish. There we go, and that's telling me at the top here, web hosting service for the domain golfswingexpert.net was set up. The next part would be to go over to my domain registrar, which would be hostdaddy, dotstar, um, yahoo, any any of the main ones there, or any domain registration company that do uh, allow you to register domains. And you go in there and you need to change your uh, the, your name servers to point to the right location. Now the Wealthy Affiliates uh, hosting that is available, if you guys are have come over from Wealthy Affiliates, welcome. If you've not come over from Wealthy Affiliates, then uh, get over there because it's a great site. Um, you, you will need to use the NS one two three dot name server dot com uh, but that is all provided by the the people that sell you the hosting uh, in this case the wealthy affiliates the the name servers uh, format will look something like this um, it's very easy very straightforward so there you go that is how to set up and configure your domain within your your web hosting on plesk uh, desktop uh, good luck I hope this has been uh, informative and useful feel free to come over to the affiliate truth.com where we have numerous videos available for uh, helping you guys out get started on the internet good luck